Okay guys, now it's time to draw the Grim Reaper as a part of our three-part Halloween series. So um, first let's start with two almost circle shapes. We're gonna go about that far and then just stop on each one. And this is gonna be for his eyes. And then what we'll do is we'll create kind of this angry eyebrow that goes on the top. So just draw a line down from the inside and then bring it over. And then on each side, we're gonna just add a little line like this to kind of give us some depth and then color in those sides dark. Now in the middle, we're gonna do a little triangle. I'm gonna make it kind of rounded on the corners. That's for the nose. And then now on the side, so the side, we're gonna go down and curve and stop right there. And we'll do that on each side. So kind of bring it down and curve in. And then because he's got the skeleton, we're gonna just draw these little bumps kind of like the bottom of the ghost and bring it up just like that. Okay, now on the top, let's just do kind of a little tent on each side and then bring those all the way down around to his teeth, just like that. Now on the top, I'm gonna create the top of his hood and we'll just bring that in like that and like that. Okay, we're getting close. Let's ignore the arms for a minute. Just create a little bit of a gap and come down and over. I'm gonna add just a little couple of cuts to his cape and then come up like that. And then where those gaps are, we're gonna just go down for his arms and his hands. We'll create a little, um, what's that called? Like a little, uh, hoop thing, I guess, uh, for his cloak. I'm gonna just draw his hands like that and we'll do that on each side. Go up, create the hoop thing. <laughs> now before I do his fingers on this one, we've gotta give him his reaper staff. So we'll do that. Just draw, uh, you know, my lines are gonna be nice and straight because I'm using my iPad, but just do the best you can with a little hook right there. And then we can just do his little fingers, just like that. Okay, we've got the Grim Reaper done um, as a part of our three character series. Now just go ahead and click on the ghost or the pumpkin, whichever one you wanna draw next, and we'll get going on them.